How are modern warships revolutionizing naval warfare with stealth, hypersonic missiles, and advanced AI systems? Today's most powerful warships are designed to dominate the seas with cutting-edge technology, unmatched firepower, and multi-role capabilities. So in this video, let's explore the top 5 next-generation warships shaping the future of naval combat. But before starting the video, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe to never miss out on any of our videos. Number 5. Hunter Class Frigate, Australia. The Hunter Class Frigate is Australia's next-generation warship designed for anti-submarine warfare, ASW, air defense, and surface combat. Based on the British Type 26 frigate, it features stealth technology to reduce its radar signature and enhance survivability. The ship is armed with a 48-cell MiG-41 vertical launch system VLS, for SM-2, SM-6, and ESSM surface-to-air missiles, providing strong air defense. It also carries Naval Strike Missiles NSM, for anti-ship warfare, and MU-90 torpedoes for ASW operations. The CFAR Phased Array Radar and Aegis Combat System ensure superior tracking and targeting capabilities. Powered by a combination of gas turbines and electric propulsion, it offers long-range endurance for extended operations. The mission bay and flight deck support helicopters like the MH-60R Seahawk and unmanned aerial vehicles UAVs. With a displacement of 8,800 tons, it is one of the largest and most capable ASW frigates in the world. The Hunter class will play a vital role in Australia's naval strategy, strengthening regional security and alliances. Number 4. Admiral Gorshkov Class Frigate, Russia The Admiral Gorshkov Class Frigate, also known as Project 22350, is one of the most advanced warships in the Russian Navy, designed for multi-role operations, including anti-ship, anti-air, and anti-submarine warfare. With a displacement of 5,400 tons, it is larger and more heavily armed than most Western frigates, giving it capabilities closer to a destroyer. The frigate is powered by a combined diesel and gas CODAG propulsion system, allowing it to reach speeds of 30 plus knots, 56 kilometers per hour, with a range of 4,500 nautical miles. It is heavily armed with 16 UKS key vertical launch system VLS cells, capable of carrying three M22 Zircon hypersonic missiles, caliber cruise missiles, and Onyx anti-ship missiles, giving it devastating offensive power. For air defense, it features the Parliament Redut system, similar to the US Aegis system, with 32 VLS cells for surface-to-air missiles SAMs. The ship's packet M key torpedo system provides an effective counter to enemy submarines, while the RBU-6000 anti-submarine rocket launcher enhances its ASW capability. It is also equipped with a 130mm A 192M naval gun, capable of engaging enemy ships, aircraft, and coastal targets. The Advanced Radar and Electronic Warfare Suite, including the FERC-4 Phased Array Radar, provides excellent situational awareness. The stealthy design incorporates radar-absorbing materials and a sleek hull shape to reduce its radar cross-section. It carries a K-27 anti-submarine warfare helicopter, further extending its operational reach against underwater threats. The ship's electronic warfare EW, and countermeasure systems help it evade enemy missiles and disrupt targeting systems. Number 3. Gerald R. Ford Class Aircraft Carrier, U.S. The Gerald R. Ford Class Aircraft Carrier is the most advanced and powerful warship in the world, designed to enhance the U.S. Navy's global power projection. At 100,000 tons and over 1,100 feet long, it is the largest aircraft carrier ever built, capable of carrying over 75 aircraft, including F-35C Lightning II stealth fighters. One of its biggest innovations is the Electromagnetic Aircraft Launch System EMALS, which replaces traditional steam catapults, allowing for smoother, more efficient aircraft launches with less wear on planes. The carrier also features an advanced arresting gear AAG, system for safer and more controlled aircraft recoveries. Its two Bechtel A1B nuclear reactors provide 250% more electrical power than previous Nimitz-class carriers supporting future energy-based weapons like railguns and laser defense systems. The reduced manning initiative and high automation allow it to operate with 600 fewer crew members than the Nimitz class, cutting costs and increasing efficiency. Its dual-band radar DBR, offers superior tracking of enemy aircraft, 
missiles, and surface threats, enhancing situational awareness. Designed for high-intensity combat, it can launch 33% more sorties per day, ensuring a faster response in battle. The carrier's stealthy design and electronic warfare capabilities make it harder to detect and jam enemy communications. With a lifespan of 50 years, the Ford class is built for long-term dominance in naval warfare. The lead ship, U.S. Gerald R. Ford, CVN-78, was commissioned in 2017, with additional carriers like U.S. John F. Kennedy, CVN-79, and U.S. Enterprise, CVN-80, under construction. The Ford class plays a central role in U.S. carrier strike groups, projecting power in strategic regions like the Pacific and the Middle East. Despite high costs, its advanced technology, improved efficiency, and increased combat capabilities make it a game-changer in naval aviation. Number 2. Type 055 Destroyer, China The Type 055 Ren High-Class Destroyer is one of the most powerful and advanced warships in the People's Liberation Army Navy PLN, designed for multi-role operations, fleet defense, and power projection. At 13,000-plus tons, it is larger than most destroyers and is closer in size to a cruiser, providing superior endurance and combat capability. The ship is armed with 112 vertical launch system VLS cells, capable of carrying a variety of weapons, including HHQ-9 long-range surface-to-air missiles, YJ-18 anti-ship cruise missiles, CJ-10 land attack missiles, and U-8 anti-submarine torpedoes. Its stealthy hull design and radar-absorbing materials reduce its radar signature, making it harder to detect despite its massive size. Equipped with a dual-band active electronically scanned array AESA, radar system, it can track hundreds of targets simultaneously, including stealth aircraft and incoming missiles. The Type 055 serves as the centerpiece of Chinese carrier strike groups, protecting aircraft carriers like the Liaoning and Shandong from aerial and naval threats. It also plays a crucial role in anti-submarine warfare ASW, using advanced sonar, torpedoes and helicopters, like the Z-20 ASW helicopter. Powered by four key C-280 gas turbines, it reaches speeds of 30 plus knots, 56 kilometers per hour, and has a range of 5,000 nautical miles, allowing for extended blue water operations. The ship is designed with high automation, reducing crew workload and increasing operational efficiency. The integrated electronic warfare, EGO, and cyber warfare systems enhance its ability to disrupt enemy communications and radar systems. The Type 055 is also expected to be equipped with future hypersonic missiles and directed energy weapons, further increasing its combat capabilities. It serves as China's answer to the U.S. Arleigh Burke class and Zumwalt class destroyers, offering the balance of firepower, stealth, and advanced technology. As of 2024, at least eight Type 055 destroyers are in service, with more planned to expand China's naval power. Its deployment in the South China Sea and Indo-Pacific region signals Beijing's intent to challenge U.S. naval dominance. The ship's modular design allows future upgrades, ensuring it remains a frontline warship for decades. With its stealth, firepower, and advanced sensors, the Type 055 represents a major leap in China's naval warfare capabilities. 1. Zumwalt class destroyer, U.S. The Zumwalt class destroyer is one of the most advanced and stealthy warships in the U.S. Navy, designed for multi-role operations, including land attack, anti-ship warfare, and naval dominance. Its unique tumble-home hull design significantly reduces its radar signature, making it appear as small as a fishing boat on enemy radar. Equipped with an integrated power system, IPS, the ship generates massive electrical power, enabling the future use of railguns, lasers, and advanced electronic warfare systems. It features 80 advanced vertical launch cells, capable of carrying a mix of Tomahawk cruise missiles, SM-6 surface-to-air missiles, and anti-submarine weapons. The Zumwalt is powered by twin Rolls-Royce gas turbines, allowing it to reach speeds of 30-plus knots, 56 kilometers per hour. Despite its massive size, Initially designed with an advanced gun system, AGS, for long-range land strikes, its 155mm guns were shelved due to costly ammunition, shifting its focus toward hypersonic missile deployment. 
The ship's automated systems allow it to operate with a crew of just 175 sailors, significantly fewer than older destroyers. Its dual-band radar DDR, and advanced sensors provide enhanced situational awareness, making it a powerful asset in both open sea and coastal operations. Despite its groundbreaking technology, the Zomolt program faced high costs and production cuts, with only three ships built instead of the Plan 32. The lead ship, U.S. Zomolt, DDG-1000, along with its sister ships, U.S. Michael Monsor and U.S. Lyndon B. Johnson, are undergoing upgrades for hypersonic missile deployment. The ship's electric propulsion system allows silent operation, reducing its acoustic signature and improving survivability against submarines. With its advanced stealth capabilities, networked warfare integration, and high-power energy systems, the Zumwalt class is a testbed for the future of naval warfare. Thank you guys for watching. If you want more videos like this, make sure to like the video and hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you in the next video.